welcome back to my channel and thank you for watching uh this video is sponsored by light of africa today is canada day and let's go out there and see how people celebrate it What do you have for me to eat? What's that? What do you want to eat? This is Tuntu and Bali. <laughs> it's called what? Tuntu. It's yam. It's roasted yam. It's called Tuntu. Okay. And then this is called Bali. It's yeah, a plantain. I would love to taste it. I'll, I'll look around, I'll watch around for you when it's done. No problem. Thanks a lot. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Chris. How are you doing? I'm Mama? fine. How are you? Hello, we are doing good. We are here mainly to, mostly and mainly to celebrate Canada Day, the first of July. You know, it's the Canada Day for our country and Canada, it's where we commemorate Canada Day. Families, compatriots, friends, and children. Whilst at the same time, also we also did our intervention project under the New Horizon project for seniors, where we invited seniors. As you can see, the lots of seniors here. We came also uh, from here, from the African diaspora community, from Jamaica, from Africa, like Zimbabwe. We got Ghanaians, we got South Africans, Swazilands, uh, their mothers and children. And they also came here. As you know, most seniors here when they came under the grandmother projects, mostly they have to be driven here by their daughters and sons. So we also have their sons and daughters. And then so that integration of approach is what we thought we can do together to celebrate a good day for Canada together as one. As you can see, we got uh, barbecues going on, uh, music in the background, and food and drink you know, catered for by the community, as well as uh, funding, some funding we got from the government of Canada under the New Horizon project, uh, project because this is a New Horizon project. Uh, so as we are, our project here also manifests also in a newsletter, because from here now onwards, 
and hence what we also before we're going to have a newsletter which uh, travelers talks about the health of African people here in Canada and the diaspora. And Chris, as you know, you're going to be also be part of what you are taking here, the experiences which you are interviewing each and every one of these people. We're going to put that into a magazine and they'll tell you the problems which they face as Africans in the diaspora. The food they've been eating back home is different from the food they're eating right now. The water, the air they breathe kind of different. The lifestyle is kind of different. So these people need a, a, a certain approach because they are seniors. Because they are seniors, we have to have another approach, scientific approach in how we do with our seniors. The food, the medication, the health and the diet. So all those things now we put that into what we're going to call the magazine for seniors. So the magazines have been going, we've launched two magazines already, uh, and then we're going to launch the third one at the end of June. So this is how we're going to launch the thing. Thank you so much, Mr. Madeira, for inviting me. And uh, well, that was a very great event. People enjoyed uh, It's not only catering for a certain country, yes. but it's all blacks from for everywhere. Yes. As you can see, all people eat. There's food for everybody. Exactly. There's drink for everybody, water, Coca-Colas and Pops. And it, just the feeling that we are here in Canada is a good, beautiful country where we are taken care of and like also in areas where we come from. But especially the fact that we are integrating well here in our community, where we talk about our issues, what sparks them. Like as you can see, the grandmothers over there, they came a long way from home. Exactly. And they're here to stay. Exactly. So we have to integrate them in our community. We have to have special approaches how to address their issues. So this is one of the reasons why we, the Black Canadian Heritage Council was formed to do and tackle with those issues. Thank you so much, Mr. Madeira, and thank you for watching. And this program is brought to you by Light of Africa. See you later. Thank you. <laughs> Guys, for the first time to eat a... a, a. Don't know. <laughs> what is it called? I think she said don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Barbecued plantain. Tastes so good. What is it? Oh, 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 Juicy, my, 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 my